Great, thanks. I'm, I'm also cheered that just put a video together that talks about this. So this is AstroPipe, which is a Python package for astronomy. And as you can see, it's in a paper um, there with lots of authors. And that's what I want to talk about today in terms of getting credit. It's possibly quite a simplistic approach. Um, this is a game generator package called uh, Axelrod, which is used to reproduce actual tournaments of the 1980s where people, where computer programs would play a business that are against each other. And this is often be used to understand how cooperation can emerge from complex situations. But sadly, all of the code, well, not all of the code, it's very much not uh, reproducible. So we put together this package, it's online, it's on GitHub, and people have contributed up to 113 strategies, which in itself makes it one of the bigger business dynamic tournaments around. Um, and that in itself has been a really fun way to do research. Now, we want to publish a paper about it, and the way we've done this is that we put, well, we have to do it opt-in, we can't just put people's names on things. So we opened up an issue on GitHub and asked people that contributed any line of code whatsoever if they wanted to be a, a, an author on the paper. And uh, the response was positive. You can see some postdocs and people saying yes. Um, there's Martin saying sure, but I only contribute code for strategies that cheat. So it seems a bit weird. Um, <laughs> some undergraduate students said uh, that contributed Holly. Um, she's already writing hilarious here because, in fact, her contribution was simply a one hour meeting with me where she said, I've got an idea for a strategy and I actually wrote the code, uh, but, but we felt that well, she pushed the commit. Uh, there's the paper is, is more or less written um, and, and we're still looking to publish it, but it's going to be open. And this is one way that I would love to hear more people's thoughts on in terms of making sure we actually get authors um, credit for their work, no matter how big, how small. One person who contributed to the library that we have included in the list is the Gitter badge. I don't know if you use Gitter, but basically a bot is not going to be an old paper. But we didn't think about it. <laughs> <laughs>